everybody. I hope you are all doing well. I wanted to address sort of a hot topic, uh, something that can cause a moment of panic in our classroom. And this is when we go to get into our classroom, open our cameras, and Minicam is no longer an option. So now I know that, that this could just cause some like major freak out. And the first thing is to think, oh no, I have to uninstall Minicam and reinstall it. The second thing is to think, oh, I'm not gonna have Minicam in my classroom. Now I have to switch to my regular camera and my student may potentially just see me sitting in front of a green screen um, and I just feel uncomfortable and nervous about teaching the whole class. It's an easy fix actually and it doesn't require you uninstalling Minicam. What you need to do is go into your Minicam and click on the gear, your settings right there. In the general tab, there is this area called virtual webcams. I really want to credit Christina Hayes for helping out so many people with this particular error. Now, in this virtual uh, webcams, you want to see that it says ready. If you go into the setting and it says failed, there's the reason why your camera is not showing up. And this can come as a result of a Windows update or any other kind of update on your computer. Simple enough. Close your VIP Kid app. Go into create new virtual web camera, uh, create new virtual camera, and just create the new camera. It might have a different name than it had before. Save it. Reopen your app. <laughs> and then in the classroom, you'll be able to select Minicam and just go right, right into teaching. It's nice and easy. It's a quick fix. Maybe a minute, if that, of your time. And so now you know, so when it happens, you can remain calm and keep teaching on. Take care.